Okay, today uh, Carla is going to do a division. She was practicing a lot about division of six. Can you do this division of six? Yes, I can do it. Okay, but you know what, Carla? I'm going to challenge you today and I'm going to put a decimal point here. So this is a fifth grade curriculum dividing decimals. So can you do it? Okay, let's try. Do it. Let's pick up. Seven divided by six equals one because one times six equals six. Subtract one, bring down the six. Sixteen divided by six equals two because two times six equals twelve. Subtract six minus two equals four, zero. Bring down the 5, 45 divided by 6 equals 7 because 7 times 6 equals 42. Subtract 5 minus 2 equals 3 and 0. And a decimal point here. Mm -hmm. And bring down the 4, 24 divided by 6 equals 6 because 6 times 6 equals Oh, no, I never do again. Okay, go, go, change it. You five, change by yourself. Five times six equals thirty. Subtract four zero. Bring down the two. Forty-two divided by six equals seven because seven times six equals forty-two. Yes. Zero. And you got a zero. Okay. So what is your final answer? Say loud. Right, use your fingers. 765 and 42 hundredths divided by 6 equals 127 and 57 hundredths. Great! So this is how a student who practices a lot uh, can do 5th grade curriculum. And she is in 4th grade class. 